Today, we're going to do something amazing. I mean, we're going to go someplace I think most people haven't been in years. But before we do that, we want to share with you an upgrade that we did at the Hershey RV show because it's a game changer as well. So much exciting stuff. Let's get to this. We have the 7.3 liter Godzilla engine. And as you know, this thing is very loud and lacks power going up steep hills. Now we got an upgrade to try to solve that problem. And I think those of you out there with this same engine would benefit from this upgrade. So let's hit the road and I'll tell you all about it. While we were at the Hershey RV show, we met a few of our viewers and they recommended this upgrade to us. And it's an upgrade from Five Star Tuning. So we decided to get the upgrade done to our RV and we're gonna go try it out. Stop us some gas first before we take this trip. Now, this tune is perfect because it's built for the 87 octane uh, tow haul mode. And that's the tune that's specifically for the Godzilla engine. This thing sped up so smoothly and so quickly. I mean, I hardly felt the shifting. There was no jolting this time. It just picked right up and got on the highway. I mean, and I'm trying to keep it low now. The thing wants to go. It really does. This is just, I mean, when you look at the numbers, it looks like a small difference, but the feel is just so different. This is, this is a lot more fun than my drive right here. <laughs> I can't wait to try it on 70. We really struggled with some of those hills that we have here in Mount in Maryland going west on 70. And so this this will be a true test to see how we do when we take it back out with the changes that were made through this this five star tuning. All right, let's go. It is much smoother shifting up. Ah, this is much easier. Another thing I noticed is I'm going 55, roughly, I think 56 right now, but I'm doing 2000 RPM on this engine right now. That's pretty low. Now that is great, 2,000 RPM at what, 55. What would it have been before about? I think it would have been closer to between three and four, but I'm not sure. And for those of us who aren't as smart about cars and engines as you are, what does it mean like if my RPMs oh, the, are lower? The engine is not working as hard to keep us at this speed. You know, it's like the difference between some of the smaller economy cars will run very high RPMs because they, they, they're not built for speed. And, and like my car in particular, a sports car, it runs at 60 to 70 and it's doing 2200 RPM because it's, it's hardly working. It's just a better tune. Oh, there's the engine. But look at this, going 55 already and I'm not even on the highway yet. Now I am. Look at this. That was easier than it used to be. Right, before, it used to be really difficult coming up that hill because it's an uphill exit for us to get on 70. And uh, it used to be really trying, trying to merge, because it's two lanes merging. And everyone's, of course, trying to get in front of me. But there, it was so easy to keep up with the cars going up that hill. I mean, I wasn't keeping up. You know, I'm, I'm big still, but I was keeping up much better. And I was already going highway speeds, 55, once I got to the top of that hill before I even merged. Now this, this is a 70 mile an hour highway, but still going 55 is better than coming up there going 45. You know, it's just, it's just much easier to merge onto the highway this way. Yeah, see it downshifted right there. It's pretty smooth on the downshift. The downshift's earlier and uh, it helps me slow down, which is great. I like this. I like this upgrade, Sherry. I'm glad we got it. 
before we head to our final cool destination, I wanted to tell you a few more things about Five Star Tune. When these RV chassis come from the factory, they're actually bare chassis, and they don't know if it's going to be a box truck, an RV, whatever. So they have a basic tune. What Five Star Tuning does is they make it specific for the F53 chassis for the RV. And using this simple device, you can tune it either yourself or you can have someone from Five Star Tuning do it for you. They save your current tune onto this device before uploading the new tune. So people are wondering, will this void your warranty? Well, what they recommend is before you go in for service, all you have to do is hook this up using their cable and download your original tune before you go in for service. And then when you come back from service, you just upload the new tune. It's pretty simple. It plugs into your ODBC port and you can do the tune as many times as you like using this device. There's no limit to how many times you can upload and download the tune. All right, now let's go head to that destination and have some fun tonight. Yay. This entrance is a little bit tight if you're coming here. So, if you don't have a guide, the plan uh, is you can help you to help guide you through this entrance here. It's a lot wider than it looks. All right. You'll be good, I think. Just take your time and you're fine. Watch your mirrors with the sign. Come this way a little bit, come straight up. Stop, stop, stop. All right, you cleared that sign. Just watch your, wait, wait, watch that sign, John. All right, just keep coming straight. Yep, you're looking good. All right. So this theater was originally opened in the 1950s and they kept much of the similar look. Yeah. And in fact, this theater has the largest movie screen in the entire United States of America. Did we tell them where we were? Oh, we're <laughs> at Benji's Drive-In Theater. Is that right? Yeah. Drive-In, not yeah. drive-through, but drive-in. Drive we're in. at Benji's Drive-In drive Theater. Yeah, don't drive through it. Now, this has been a staple in Maryland for a very long time, and Benji's just recently joined Harvest Host. So if you have a Harvest Host membership and you're going down 95 north or south and going through the Baltimore County area, yep. this is a great stop for you. I mean, where else can you get a movie, you can get dinner, and you can get a Harvest Host night stay. Let me turn you around this way. Let's see how RV, look! There it is! There it is! The big right screen! There. So we're really excited because tonight they are showing The Joker and then they're showing another movie that I don't want to see. So we're going to lock up the RV, put down all the shades, and go do something else for the second feature. Yeah, it's a, it's a pretty scary Halloween slasher type movie and she's not into those. Not for me! No way! Get my hot dog set up. All the mustard. You got the foot long. I did. I'm hungry. You haven't eaten since breakfast. Nope. Neither have I. I got the burger. And some relish. <laughs> 